Hey YouTube, it's Hake here, and in this video I'm going to show you how to add more CPU cores to VirtualBox. Now a lot of you may know this already, but there's a lot of people out there that may actually not be using VirtualBox to its full advantage. I was one of them. I actually have a pretty good processor, but I was only using one of my CPU cores at a, on the uh, VirtualBox, and uh, I had three other cores available that I wasn't using, and I was trying to run Windows 10 on a uh, VM, and it was running quite slow. So, um... This will show you how you can enable more than one core on VirtualBox. And I know a lot of people probably already know this, but there's probably people out there that actually don't. And uh, before we do that, let's find out how much cores you have. The best way you can do that, actually, on here is to come down to your Start menu, right-click, go into Task Manager here, and we can take a look in Performance section. And under CPU, if we right-click here, and we go to Change Graphics to Logical Processors, we can see here under cores that I got four cores alright so I'm just gonna uh, enable all four cores on the virtual box so by default it was only running on one core so if I come into virtual box and I right click on a VM and I go into the settings here you will see here that if I click on system then processes processors you can see I'm using one one core you can actually slide this over to four cores and click OK and now you're using all four of your cores your CPU cores and um, you will have much better performance running an operating system like Windows 10 in a virtual environment. I was basically handicapped to myself the whole time before I was told by a friend that you can enable more cores and after enabling all four cores the, C the virtual machine ran much faster so I just thought to make this video out there for those of you that are having problems running Windows 10 on VMware or VirtualBox Maybe if you add more cores to it, it will make a big difference because that was what my issue was. I couldn't run anything, I didn't run that well with running on one core. So that's how you add uh, more cores to uh, VirtualBox. And if you enjoy my videos, remember to write, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.